highest of heights to the depths of the sea. Creations revealing your majesty. From the colors of fall to the fragrance of spring. Every creature unique in the song that it sings. All exclaiming, indescribable, uncontainable You place the stars in the sky and you know them by name You are amazing God All powerful, untamable, all struck we fall to our knees as we humbly proclaim of heights to the depths of the sea creations revealing your majesty from the colors of fall to the fragrance of spring every creature unique in the song that it sings all
It's another Bible story with Pastor G. And today we'll be going over Jesus is Risen. On the first day of the week, very early in the morning, the women took the spices they had prepared and went to the tomb. They found the stone rolled away from the tomb, but when they entered, they did not find the body of the Lord Jesus. While they were wandering about, su suddenly two men in clothes that gleamed like lightning stood beside them. In their fright, the women bowed down with their faces to the ground. But the men said to them, Why do you look for the living among the dead? He is not here. He has risen. Remember now how he told you while he was still with you in Galilee. The Son of Man must be delivered over to the hands of sinners, be crucified, and on the third day be raised again. Then they remembered his words, After three days I will rise again. We're going to take a look at a classic a video that probably many of you guys watched, but is so relevant to today's teachings. So let's watch it again, guys.
this have to happen, John? Jesus never did anything wrong to anybody. He healed, he preached, and he loved those in need, including me, a sinner like me. We were all sinners, Mary, and he told us that this was going to happen according to his Father's will. I don't know why it had to happen, and I don't know why it had to happen this way, but he said that there was a purpose to it. What purpose could there be in killing a man in cold blood? He did nothing wrong. His only crime was loving us. <sighs> I can't believe he's gone. Jesus? Yes. But Jesus. 
Jesus is standing right there. What? I don't see anyone. Where did you see? Where did those two men go? My, what happened here, miss? you guys enjoyed the puppet show uh for some of you that was probably familiar but the puppet show is really telling about how uh god really um kept this promise about coming back um we have to understand it's not just about how he died on the cross but how he came back that makes it really different a lot of people died on the cross back in the day but only one person resurrected from it after three days. And that's Jesus, guys. So just remember, only one person ever did that. And only one person will ever will. Because he wanted to show us that there is life after death. And he wanted to also show us that if you and I believe in him, we believe in uh, how he died for us on the cross and how he died for our sins, we're all going to go to heaven and become a spirit that meets with him later on. Let's all pray, guys. Father, I want to thank you so much for gathering all of us here today. We thank you so much for the cross, and also thank you so much that you rose again on the third day to show us that we are nothing without you and that we need you in our lives to continue to grow and spiritually and to uh, put our trust and faith in you, Lord. Uh, we thank you so much for Jesus, Father God, that through um, today's puppet show and um, today's lesson that you showed us that we can get closer to you and uh, we can also go to heaven after we die as long as we trust in you as long as we believe in you and as long as we know that um, you are the son of God and died for our sins we thank you so much Father God for this time we ask of you for protection for the rest of the week and for the rest of the time Lord I pray all Jesus name Amen bye guys I'll see you guys next week 